All right, back from Chile with Brett Bruin from Global Situation Room. Um, this is about board perspectives, um, Brett. Um, obviously, board members have to be, you know, valued leaders. They have to be contributors. How do you, how do you view what's the right fit on boards, to big and small companies entering, if you will, the Global Situation Room? You know, I think on any board you want to have a diversity of views and that the greatest mistake that a company can make um, is to either have uh, a board that's filled with um, folks that only come from that sector right. or who only represent um, one viewpoint or background. Um, you also obviously want to have uh, people who can um, see the bigger picture and, and certainly um, someone who is too stuck into um, one point of view isn't going to make constructive contributions to a board. But um, they can make invaluable um, contributions, uh, provide uh, really important insights. And so I would encourage when selecting a board um, to look very closely at the diversity of backgrounds in, in all respects. I think you know there's a lot of emphasis that's put on um, diversity for um, just presenting uh, right. to the public a, a diverse board, but you really want to look at the diversity of experiences, the diversity of knowledge, um, and that, that goes far beyond just ensuring that you have um, a diversity that uh, seems diverse rather than is in fact um, going to give you the most diverse uh, points of view possible. Yeah, I'm probably hanging around the Brits too much because I'm going to say that's another brilliant remark. Um, but um, absolutely, we concentrate a lot on diversity, which is good, but diversity of, of, of qualities and skill sets is, is critical. Thanks for sharing that.